how to write lower and upper case alphabets n d e and f okay first take your english notebook and come that is the four line notebook have you all taken your english note fine now open your notebook have you all opened and now i have written upper and lower case d upper and lower case e and turn of the page upper and lower case f so parents kindly help of the kids by using the help of the scale and pencil i have divided the pages into three equal parts that is in this page i have divided into three equal parts and in this page also i have divided and on the next page also i have divided into three equal parts fine now we are going to write upper and lower case d kids just see carefully take your pencil and go on to the top that is to the first red line and draw a straight standing line to the bottom that is to the to the last red line and again to the top draw a left curve round about to the bottom that's it it's upper case d and for the lower case d go to the top that is to the first red line draw a standing line till the third line that is till the second black line and from the second and the third line that is from the first black line and to the second black line draw a right curve round about and that's it it's d lower case d and again we'll make a try go to the top to the red line draw a standing line to the bottom and from there and again for the lower case go to the top from the red line to the third line that is to the last black line draw a standing line and from the second line that is from the first black line draw a right curve round about that's it we are done and next we move on to the next column go to the top that is to the first red line draw a straight standing line and again go to the top draw a left curve round about to the bottom and for the lower case d go to the top that is to the red line and draw a straight standing line and in the middle that is from the first black line draw a right curve to the second black line that's it okay kids now i am writing this line too go to the top draw a straight standing line and a left curve round about and this is upper case d and for the lower case go to the top draw a standing line from the first red line to the last black line and in between the two black lines draw a right curve round about that's it and again go to the top a left curve full left curve and to the top again till the third line and in between the first and the second black line draw a right curve and again finally standing line left curve and again from to the first and the third line and in between the two black lines draw a right curve that's it we are done and kids you're going to do the rest of the columns and rows okay fine when we move to the letter e now we are going to write letter e in both upper and lower case e is quite easy come let's try go to the top 
to the first red line draw a straight standing line and in the top that is in the first red line draw a sleeping line to your right and in the middle that is the second black line draw one more small sleeping line and in the bottom draw again one more sleeping line that's it it's uppercase E and for the lowercase E in between these two black lines Draw a small sleeping line in the middle and draw a right curve round about to the bottom. It should be in between the two black lines. Okay? Just be careful whether it's not going out. Fine. We'll try it again. Go to the top. Draw a straight standing line and in the first red line draw a sleeping line to your right. To the second black line, draw one more sleeping line and in the bottom, draw one more sleeping line to your right. That's it. And in between the two black lines, in the middle, draw a small sleeping line. Can you able to see? And draw a right curve round about. It should be in between the both two black lines. And again, to the top, draw a straight standing line. A sleeping line on the top, a sleeping line in the middle and a sleeping line in the bottom. And in between the two black lines, the middle draw a small sleeping line and a right curve. That's it. And again, a standing line, a sleeping line, again a sleeping line in the middle and again a sleeping line in the bottom. In between the two black lines, draw a small sleeping line and a right curve that's it and again a standing line sleeping line sleeping line sleeping line that's it and again a small sleeping line and a right curve finally a standing line sleeping line on the top sleeping line on the middle sleeping line on the bottom in between the two black lines, draw a small sleeping line and a right curve. That's it. It should not go out of the two black lines. And kids, now we are going to complete the rest of the place. Turn off your page. And now we are going to see how to write letter F in both upper and lower case. It is also quite easy, very easy. And now draw a standing line. And on the top, that is on the first red line, draw a sleeping line to your right. And in the middle, that is from the, on the second black line. And draw one more sleeping line. That's it. It's uppercase F. And for lowercase F, go to the top, that is to the first red line. Do a small curve over there and draw a standing line. And in the middle, that is on the first black line, draw a sleeping line. That's it. It is easy, right? Now we'll try again. Top, standing line. And again, draw a standing line. And in the top, draw a sleeping line. And in the middle, that is in the second black line, draw one more small sleeping line. And for the lower case, go to the top, make a small curve and a standing line. And in the middle, that is in the first black line, draw a small sleeping line. That's it. It's lower case F. And again, we'll try. Kids, listen carefully. A standing line, a sleeping line, and in the middle, one more sleeping line. And for lower case, draw a small curve, a standing line. In the middle, a sleeping line. That's it. And I'll do it again, a standing line, a top, a sleeping line and in the middle one more sleeping line. And again a small curve, a standing line, in the middle a sleeping line. And again a straight standing line, sleeping line to your right, in the middle one more sleeping line. Small curve, a standing line, in the middle small sleeping line. 
again standing line, sleeping line, sleeping line and again a small curve, a small standing line and a sleeping line. That's it. We are done. And kids, now we are going to do it by yourself and to I'm going to complete the rest of the pages. Meet you all again soon. Hope you all have enjoyed this session and have learned how to write letter D, E, F in both upper and lower case. Okay, fine. Until then, bye-bye. Meet you soon.